Okay guys, so I'm going to read The Roommate because the last book that I read was pretty intense and I just want something that's kind of like fun and cool and like not going to make me think about a whole lot. So I've decided on The Roommate by Rosie Dannon. I heard about this book and I thought it sounded interesting so we'll give it a go and see what I think. Okay, I don't like Everett all that much, but I will say that he does have a Jeep Wrangler, so he gets a couple, like, bonus points just for that alone. Just saying. So, chapter one, Everett picks up um, Clara, takes her to the apartment, basically drops her at the door, doesn't even go inside. He's like, yeah, I knew we were going to live together, but I'm leaving because the band has, like, some kind of tour, and now you're going to be living with this dude. <laughs> who he doesn't even know like they just met like online and he's like hey want to rent this room so Josh is the other roommate so it's just going to be Josh and Clara they don't know each other they weren't introduced by Everett I mean it's just kind of weird um so they're just kind of like doing their introductions and I don't know it should be interesting let's move on to chapter two Where'd he go? What? It's unacceptable, isn't it? How dare he ride around on the lawnmower? Hey guys, what's up? A good day. It is Wednesday. Got today and tomorrow. I'm off work on Friday. Just trying to get through everything. I was having a really bad struggle this morning with my workout. I did about 15 minutes and I had to stop. I'm gonna try to do it again at lunchtime, see if I can get through my full 45 minutes that I'm supposed to do outside. Um, I'm not sure what's going on. My calf is really hurting. I tried to roll some dice and see if I could figure out what was going on. Um, I think I have a direction to go in, so I'm just gonna kinda do that. And, uh, see what happens but I'm going to continue to push through so yeah there's that we're taking Marnie out for her little walk right now hopefully she'll go to the bathroom and then I can get on with the rest of my day face to face in this trashy bar another glass and I am going places makes me laugh above the irony of everything I like the way you're thinking I don't really care about So this is the puzzle that we're currently working on and this is giving us a fit. It looks pretty cool. We've got the trees 
or what is getting us, but uh, that's kind of where we're at right now with this one. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to my garage, which is a mess. I'm doing a three card pull from tarot cards, and then I think I'll do another three card pull with um, playing cards, so tarot and playing cards. And um, Greg and I are getting ready to head out for the day. It's Friday, we got the doors off, and Greg's trying to finagle a way to keep the cooler in the um, Jeep. Let me show you guys what we got going on here. So, we're trying. So, I got the back seat out of the Jeep because we don't need it. Um, but we're trying to keep this cooler in here without it flying somewhere or losing the lid. So, that's Greg's project right now while I do my card pool. This is the card deck I'm working with today. The Dark Mansion Tarot. I don't know why. I was just pulled to this deck this morning. This is what we've got. We have the High Priestess, the Six of Cups, and the King of Wands. Let's see how the day plays out. Okay, Greg and I are out here at the Gettysburg Outlets, and there are so many stores that are closed. It's actually kind of sad. But the stores that we came here for are here. I wanted to go to the Jerky store and the Calendar store. We still have like a 15-ish minutes before anything opens. We might go to Bath and Body Works, and I want to check out, there's a pepper place, right babe? We gotta yeah. check that out. There's a pepper place that's never been here before. Um, Vera Bradley um, just opened a store here. But they can blame um, this on, they can blame it on COVID-19, but I've been in here and the prices are ridiculous. Yeah, some of the prices are actually really ridiculous. So it's not too surprising some of the stores closed, but definitely I'd say that. But it's a lot of them. Co yeah, COVID really, did a lot of it. I mean, there's a lot of empty spaces here. Kind of sad. And we have the pride flags and lights. Oh, look at all the colorful lights. Whoop whoop. All right, we're gonna check. We're gonna check some things out. We'll see if there's anything that we can buy. They have a. It's called like it's a pepper bar or something. Hey, I don't even know what it's called. The, what? Um, escape room that's here. It never, it never even opened. Uh, it yeah, closed. yeah, it closed before <laughs> it even opened. No escape room. Tablets was there. There was a major fire in Gettysburg. It took out the crystal wand shop that I like to go to, although they have a new location. I have to find out where that is so I can stop in. This right here, it's Pepper the Palace. Pepper Palace. They've got a free sample bar, hot sauce, salsa, seasoning and rubs. Okay. All right now. And there's another store that is gone. All right, good news guys. The Oshagosh Bagosh store survived. It is still here. It is a thing. There you go. Alright, we have arrived at the the pepper place. Let's see what they got in here. Never mind, I guess we're not going in there because they don't have the doors unlocked. Can't go in. So I guess we're gonna head to the the game store, the game calendar store. Okay, we made it to the Go Games and Toys. Let's see if we can find some jigsaw puzzles or some playing cards. Ah, oh, we've got puzzles. This one right here was awful to do. <laughs> hey, that's the one we just finished. What was the hardest part of that? This and this and the whole, that the whole lot of it. Right there, <laughs> where that board was. Oh, let's see what we got here. Oh, 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 oh. Home sweet home. That's cute. 550 pieces. 
Oh, I like these flashback puzzles. These are fun. They have Golden Girls, RBG, candy wrappers, the Breakfast Club, the Office. What'd you find? Oh, that is a cool one. It looks like TV when I was a kid. All I like, I like that. That is really cool. You want me to put that to the side? Oh, Lord. Oh, no. What? That is so you. I only see this on that one website. I've never seen it anywhere else. Really? Yeah. I and mean... It's $17.99 on there. How much is it here? It's free. It's free! <laughs> okay. Look at how annoying this would be. <laughs> Actually, that may not be too difficult. And we got... Let's see what else we got. There are so many puzzles. Rubik's cubes. I like that one too. That's cool. That's a thousand piece puzzle too. Who makes it? Um, Go Games. Never heard of it. Is that like the house puzzle or something? Look, they know. If you're going to do a puzzle, you have to have wine. <laughs> Yay, we're heading to the beef jerky outlet store. They have really spicy jerky. Let's see. 